Welcome. In front of me is a Huawei MediaPad T5, and today I will show you how to bypass the Google verification screen. And as you can see, the tablet in front of me is locked, and without the correct Google account and password for it, I cannot basically get further. So to bypass it, we're gonna go back to the network selection. So let's right here. And then whatever network you're connected to, just forget it. And from here, uh, choose a network that actually has a protection, like let's say this one, I'm gonna connect to it. Um, and from here, tap on the advanced options, put in the password for this for this network. So I'm just gonna do that off the screen. Okay. So once it's put in, um, from here, scroll down. And when you have proxy, tap on it and choose manual. And the proxy hotspot name, type in abcd.com. Now mind you that once you press the period, it's gonna do all kind of wonky stuff, so. And when you press comma uh, or period, I meant, um, it's gonna create a space. Now make sure there is no space, otherwise this won't work. So just remove that space and then type in com, like so. And then to proxy port, type in 8080, like so. And then connect. Stop on next. Now, if you don't see a message above the network uh, in a yellow color, just try it again, type on next, or not a red, I mean, not yellow, but red. Okay, so as you can see, there is a message. So from here, what you wanna do is tap on the exclamation mark, right here, and then select enable to find hotspot and then tap on learn more stop on next and agree now let's stop the back button and let's try it again I just say yes. Okay, so from here, let's go through this. Just start on, tap on start, then tap on deny. Yeah. From here, search. Okay. Um, so I just typed in AAA and then select email. Then tap on the Gmail icon right here, tiny one. So tap on it. Okay, let's skip this. Oh, I know what I did. Um, so back here, when you search for, tap on the email, uh, actually hold it, don't tap it. So if you hold it, it will get the, the app info. Okay, so from here, uh, I'm gonna go into the notifications right here, then more settings. 
on the three dots up here and manage accounts. And then select just once. From here, scroll all the way down into the system. Tap on reset and then choose reset all settings right here. Confirm it, reset all settings. Now what this will do is basically forget any kind of previous account that was previously logged in here and any kind of other settings that might have been done to this device. Okay, so once that's done, just go back. Oh, one more time back to the main system settings page. So right here and then navigate into the display. So right here and then choose home screen style right here and just change to drawer give it a moment and as you can see we're now in the home screen so what you want to do now is go into the settings app Go again all the way down into the system, again reset and perform a factory data reset. Like so confirm it and let the process go through. And once, once it's finished we're going to be back in the setup screen but this time basically the device will be without any kind of uh, previous account so we can then set up the device as we like. And as you can see now the process is finished and you can set up your device and it's fully unlocked. So you can connect to whatever you like and everything will be working just fine. And if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe and thanks for watching.